Now, farming shrimp isn't as easy as just throwing feed into a tank. You have to constantly monitor and adjust the water to make sure those shrimp stay healthy. I do 11 different tests on every tank every day. We test for temperature, dissolved oxygen, salinity, alkalinity, pH, nitrates, nitrites, ammonia, carbon dioxide, bioflock, which is our heterotrophic bacteria, and mortality. Those are the tests that we do, and those lead us to what we would do with our four inputs. Our four inputs that we put into the tank are feed. We will put in simple syrup. That is a supplemental feed source for our bacteria. We will put in a probiotic. That is dried bacillus or the active culture in yogurt. We will also put in on a needed basis sodium bicarbonate or baking soda. And that just helps us control our pH and our alkalinity of the water. If you run a shrimp farm properly, you can keep everything in check and everything in balance. It changes over time as you're harvesting shrimp out or when you're stocking at the beginning because your target is always moving, always moving. And each tank is different. My Excel spreadsheet on my tracking, on our testing is ridiculous, but you have to watch that because if you lose shrimp, you lost money. So you don't want to lose any shrimp. So make sure that you're making the right decisions on your water quality and on your shrimp health to make sure everything goes right every day.